I'm Jay Maisel. I started in 1954 professionally. Every once in a while, you get lucky. Many times when you do everything right and you're not lucky, you don't get the shot. But then there are other times when, due to no intelligence on your part, everything comes together and you get a wonderful photograph. You know, one guy said to me once, it's a shame you're always shooting, you never get to see anything. And I had to explain to him that I was seeing a lot and that part of why I go places is to see. Possibly for a photographer, sometimes it's not a completed vision unless you can get it down on paper some way or another. One of the things that upsets a lot of young photographers, they would see something wonderful and they couldn't get it. And I would say, don't berate yourself. You saw it. You live in a very beautiful world. And thus, everything is available. It's your picture. Do whatever you want with it. I try to be open to whatever's out there and not go out there with a preconceived idea of what I'm going to do. Somebody once said that the harder they work, the luckier they got. And I believe it's a matter of putting in time. Put it this way. If you decide that you're going to shoot a red umbrella held by a girl wearing a blue dress, you're going to be looking all day for that. And you're going to miss everything that's around. Don't be bound by any rules. There are no rules. I mean, that's rule number one. When I see a piece of work that needs a lot of explanation, I already have doubts. I always wanted to do a book called, Hey Look, because that's what you say when you're walking around, you see something with somebody you're walking with, Hey, look at that, my God, that's incredible. One of the things I like about Chromalux, aside from the quality of it, is the permanence of it. Of all the things I've come in contact with, this is the only thing I know that you don't have to treat with kid gloves. The Chromalux will be available, not just to me, but for other people after I'm gone. You know, the, the old advice, find something you love to do and you'll never have to work a day in your life. I love that one.